We're out traveling in Vermont today, checking out some of the fall foliage. And we're gonna go through Smuggler's Notch to stow and ride the gondola and stow. Got my mom here from Kansas. So we're gonna go check out some fall foliage. All right, check out this waterfall. So pretty out here. We got this guy's playing the guitar. That was pretty awesome. He gave us a little ditty. Um, we're gonna head on, go through the notch. The kids are in school today, but this is actually one of my favorite spots in the notch to stop with the kids because they have like caves all throughout these rocks and you can just kind of like climb and explore for a while. So we're just going to take some photos and some video and then move on because we really want to make it to the gondola before it's packed for the day. So let's get some photos, some video, and we'll keep heading through the notch. This is what I'm talking about with the caves, but these are like small portions of it. Like you can take off up there and climb and you'll run into a cave system at some point that will shoot you out somewhere else. We are here at the gondola. It's actually called the Mansfield Gondola from here. And I think if you get on over at the Stowe Resort, it's the Stowe Gondola. Although every one of the cars says Stowe on it. All right. Either way, we're excited to see what we can see up there. It's beautiful. Notches behind us. Just came through the notch that way. Here we go. Little photo spot right there. Here's our photo from it. We're headed up Mount Mansfield. Mount Mansfield is the tallest peak in Vermont. Although I don't think it's taken us to the top, but I believe you can keep hiking if you want. We'll find out when we get up there. But I feel like if you wanted to, you could still hike to the top from where this lands off. But we're gonna just probably check it out from the landing up here. And we don't know what's happening. <laughs> Hopefully it's nothing major because we're about that close to the end. But we're that far from the bottom. It's rocking quite a bit. If this is found footage, please tell my family I love them. <laughs> 
Oh, we're moving. <laughs> we're moving. It's okay now. Made it to the top. There's this uh, cute little gift shop. We did a little gift shop inside, and this is what I'm seeing up here. Super cool, the lookout tower back there. We're gonna go check out the Cliff House restaurant. You do have to have a reservation today, but nothing says you need a reservation to grab a drink at the bar. So I think it's about time. So in spite of them uh, being only reservation, we got a table and uh, got an old fashioned. It's pretty good, it's a maple old fashioned. Very good. Um, kind of weird though, you do have to go up and order your food and then you sit back down. But they do bring it to you, so that's all right. But my mom's got a margarita and you've got great views. Great views out the windows, awesome. We're about to hop on the shorter gondola that goes over to the village at Stowe, so at their resort, and we're gonna head over there and check it out. So getting on this one, just got off the one that went up to Mansfield. So we'll see what the little village at Stowe's like. Oh, Nelly. <laughs> we're crazy. The mountain doesn't look so big from over here, but it was way up there, but we're headed this away. And in this one, you can stand up. See? You can sit down, but we don't want to sit down. We're over at the Stowe Village at the Beanery. Grabbed a double espresso. I think we're about to head back home, though. This trip's about done, but we're going to check out some more stuff, and we'll see how this ends. way up there. Colors in Vermont in the fall are like nothing else. Highly recommend visiting mid to late September to mid to late October. But every year it's different, so you gotta time it right. This year we're October 6th, I think, and it's perfect. Fifth. <laughs> See, this is about as pretty as it gets today. So we had a great time driving through Smugs, checking out all the fall foliage here in Vermont. I really recommend this area of Vermont for fall foliage. If you ever get a chance to get out here, do it. This road here in Smugs is closed down after October and before May. So no driving on it in the winter because it's just a slick mess and they just don't let you go down it. If you enjoyed my mom and I's adventure, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. And if you wanna see more videos like this in New England, check out my New England travel playlist right here. And I hope you go enjoy your own travels and make your own adventures happen. I'll see you guys next week with another one. 
from our Route 66 playlist. All right, peace out.